it better not take too long. Out of the car. Oh, out of the God, car. That's all right. What? Open the boots. There's nothing in it, mate. Get in. Please, mate. Stop Please. talking. So, Brian, tell us about your special sheep. Well, my family's been farming this land for about 200 years, and as far as I know, we've got the only flock of ginger sheep in the world. Extraordinary, so these are actually unique. Uh, yes, because we don't let them breed off the farm. So how do they differ from other breeds? Well, they're almost different from other breeds. They're, they're, they're docile, uh, they're good mothers and, and, and lamb early, and they're not too active, which is just as well, because the dog's not as young as she was. As someone once said, life is pleasant. Death is peaceful. It's the transition that's troublesome. What's wrong? Well, somebody has keyed our car and slashed the tires. What? Oh, I am sorry. But you see who did it? <laughs> no, no. Have you got any surveillance cameras around? No, sorry, sorry, mate. No, we don't. Um, just so that you know, I mean, just so that I've said it. That won't drive anymore. No. There's oil on your hand. Yeah. No, you can't have a sniff of a rat in my business. Hmm. Interesting blend. My mother, the poor dear, has had no end of trouble with the little blighters. They chew right through her lounge rug. So I took her a new one. Rather trivial, I suppose. Nothing compared to what you must be going through. But you must be relieved to hear that they've charged someone with George's accident. <coughs> Mrs. Merriwell? <coughs> Mavis? Morning, John. Morning. Do you hear they've closed another cattle market? I've heard. It's one thing after another. What I want to know is what's being done about it. Don't worry, there are last minute attempts to keep the market. They're in discussion at the moment. I'll let you know what the outcome is. Thanks very much. I absolve you all. Amen. Amen. <laughs>